Be like, perfectly honest. Trespassing, with you. right? Absolutely not. Okay. You can't so trespass they're, they're, in public. They're asking you to, to leave. They're asking me to leave for 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 what crime? What crime did I commit? They're not saying you committed a crime. They're just asking you to leave. Because well, I have a right to say no, don't I? As an American taken, citizen. Taking your video. Who? It's not up to listen, you listen, or listen, them to tell me taking, what I'm done. But you said you've taken your content. I'm not done though. You got your FOIA request, and then she gave you the first name to fill out the the complaint. That's correct. Okay, so what else do we need to do? Okay, so I'm gonna say this one more time. Because they're still trying to do business. They can they, I'm not gonna impede on that at all. Alright, what's up guys? We're gonna do this video for Tyrant Terminator Audits. I absolutely love this guy's channel. I like his demeanor. I like the way he asserts himself out there. I like the way he conducts these First Amendment audits. He's doing a fantastic job. Should everybody become a First Amendment auditor? Probably not. Should everybody pick up a camera and record? Absolutely. Especially when you are conducting a transaction with your government installation. Whether it's the DMV, whether it's the IRS, whatever your transaction is, because you guys have to understand that government is a business. Every single government installation is a business. When you are dealing with government, you are conducting a transaction. They look at you as a client. Keep in mind that you are the taxpayer, you are the boss, and these servants cannot stop you from doing what is what you're allowed to do because what's not forbidden is allowed, right? The reason people go in there and conduct these First Amendment audits is because nobody seems to know the First Amendment anymore. The person watching right now, do you know what the First Amendment is? There's five elements to it. Hold on, you don't have to Google it. I will explain it to you really quick. You have a freedom of speech, freedom of press, freedom of religion, freedom to assemble, and freedom to petition your government for a redress of grievances. All five of those elements are extremely important, so important that the Second Amendment was written to protect it. These documents, the First Amendment, the Bill of Rights, the Constitution, these documents don't give us our rights. We were born with natural rights. These documents limit the scope of authority that these public officials have over we the people. That's why public servants, they thought that they had all the power in the world. They could make you sit down in the lobby, yada, yada, yada. And if you don't obey or, or comply with our demands when we want you to, you know, we won't even service you. This type of behavior has gone on far too long. And that's why people that see these videos, well, there's a lot of mixed emotions in there, but... I think if you've been ever treated like crap by one agency or installation of your government, these types of videos, you really be begin to appreciate them. And uh, that's why when I see a channel like Tyrant Terminator Audits, who you could tell he's a G, but he's not going in there to become a douchebag or just, you know, you know, be rude or nothing. He's in there asserting himself, conducting First Amendment audits. In my opinion, he does them real professionally. And uh, I, li I, like, I like his work. I really like his work. So I would like for you guys to subscribe to him and let's watch this video. Lake County Housing, how can I help you? Yes, I'm here to uh, collect some documents and a couple of FOIA requests. First, they want us asking for permission to be free, but now we gotta press buttons to be free, guys. Press a button to be free. Um, first I'm going to document the building, but I need some FOIA requests. Uh, who are you here to see? No one in particular. I mean, I'm trying to figure out who you're trying to get the documents from. From you guys. You guys uh, supply the documents. Okay. Are you from a company that sent you here? I'm trying to figure out. Um, I don't really want to answer those questions. I just need the paperwork. Hmm. I don't think he was being rude at all. Is there a reason why we're recording something? No, I'm just documenting, right. get, getting the building, getting footage of the building. And, well, it's, just, it's okay, right? Yeah, it should be fine. Okay. You should be fine, sir. You should be fine. What, what is a FOIA? Yeah. It's a Freedom this of Information Act. <laughs> His fucking face. 
And is this the is this the login sheet right here? It is. Okay. We're not giving you permission to report right now. Who are you here to see? Can you please put the phone down? What's your name? I'm a teacher. Can you please put the phone down? Excuse, what's your name again? Okay. We'll have somebody come down for you. Thank you. Mm. She was rude. Mm. Unprofessionally rude. rude. We're not giving you permission to be free right now, sir. Unprofessionally rude. Excuse me, lady. Yes. More of the same. Did you get permission to be free today, sir? <laughs> what now? Sir, Dad, I'm not giving you permission to record, so I'm going to ask you to put the phone down. I don't down. need permission, ma'am. Okay, so I'm going to ask you to put the phone down. We can assist you. I need to know who you need to see. I spoke to the young lady already, and that's I asked you who your name was. You, you're engaging me and not even telling me your name. Why should I no, tell you anything? I'm asking you to put the phone down. Okay. Okay. I mean, what's so your position here? What it is that you, or who you're looking to speak to and for what reason. I told the young lady already. The, okay, I'm asking you. Okay, I told her. Maybe you I'm should asking, refer to her. I'm her manager. Okay, so what's your position here, man? I'm her manager. So if she, if I conveyed it to her already, why can't you just go Sir, get the... I'm not going to be combative with you. I'm, I'm not going to be combative with you. How can I assist you? I don't need assistance from you. Okay, so then can we ask you to leave the building or should we... I mean, ask me to leave the building for what I'm... I'm because we're asking how to assist you and you're not responding. So what does that mean? I'm, I'm, I don't need assistance from you. You should go back to work. Respectfully. This is my job. Okay, well, not, to, not to interrogate me. It isn't. Sir, I'm not interrogating you. I'm asking you how to assist you. I don't need assistance from you. Okay, so do we need to get you escorted or do you want to be assisted? Es escorted how? I'm asking you how to be assisted. If not, we're going to ask you to leave the building because you're not informing me what it is that you need Damn. to do. Well, I'm going. If you're going to ask me to leave the building, I'm going to respectfully decline. Okay. So, do you need assistance? Not from you. Do you need assistance? I told the young lady already. She told me she'd get back and to she me. She came to me. Because well, I'll wait for her to come back to the desk because you're rude. I'm not being rude. To you me, are. Actually. You are. Not. You are. How can you be helped? I'm not going to lie. That's that's a pretty sick ass strategy to conduct a First Amendment audit. Like, you're rude. I'm not talking to you. Go send that crybaby who went back there to, to call you. Go send her back out here. Because I'm not going to lie. The other lady was a crybaby to go crying to this one. And then here comes this one. Oh, dun, 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 dun. Turn, your, turn your camera off. Put it off. Get outside. We're going to escort you out of here. And you got Mr. Crybaby over here on the left. You know, he was like, we're not sure if you're allowed to be free, sir. And then, uh, and then. And then when the, when the camera panned back over to him, he was just standing there like this. Like, looking like, shit, he's still here. He's still here in our building, the, this building that was given to us. This is our building, right? <laughs> that's, that's exactly how they're acting, like if it's their building. Am I, am I seeing things? <laughs> again, I'm going to say it again in English this time. The young lady... I'm being disrespectful, but you came off as disrespectful as soon as you engaged no, me. Yes, you are. Can you be I don't need assistance from you. Okay. That, that should be the end of that. Assistance? Not from you. Do you need assistance? Not from you. I'm asking, do you need assistance? I'm not from a rude person like you, no. What assistance is it that you need? I don't need assistance from you. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I will okay, keep you asking you so. the same question. This time I'll try to I said, ask you I don't the need same question. From you. You're rude. Way. You're right away. You're extremely rude. As soon as you, as soon as you come up to the window, and, and, and how many times do I have to say it? Fucking hilarious! <laughs> uh, uh, Absolutely you know, brilliant, people, bro. You know they 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 can come out and be rude and then expect for you to be nice and polite. I'm sick of that. Hey, sir, so is, Outstanding. Seriously? Yeah, I mean, this I'm guy. recording because I, I can't. Uh, uh, uh. I know you can't. But, right, but so like, that, that's all That's all the reason I need. No, I understand that, right. but like, I mean, they're assisting you, and you're getting what, what you need, so why right. is there, like, a conflict trying to, you know? Well, they creating a the conflict. They, you know, I know that's your supervisor, so you're going to speak highly of her, and no, you're going to no, talk in her favor. That is a supervisor. I understand so that. Building, you know? I understand that, but that still does not give her a right to come try to be uh, extremely so rude. Is, is that we don't really have a lot of people coming in here. See, so this is the young that lady that helped matter. me the first time. Yeah, we know. That's what I'm saying. So I don't, what's the problem? <laughs> this is the young lady right here that, that, that helped me the first time. Where she was getting ready to. Sir, 
How you doing? My How name you is doing? Gerald Cole. I'm the housing choice voucher manager. <laughs> okay. Okay, I hear you have a request for a FOIA. That's correct. Here's how you file a FOIA with us. It gives okay. you links and websites. All right. And the type of information you can request. Okay, dokie. We are public Auditors have been doing this kind of shit for a long time. And we know for a fact that there has to be forms there. If they don't have them readily available, they're supposed to print them out for the people. <laughs> Yay! We figured this out a long time ago. But here's the thing. Um, these public officials always come out with the same crap. You know, uh, go look at it online. Here's how you can file a complaint. Here's how you do a FOIA request. Here's how you do this. We don't want to do anything for you here. Just go do it online. What the fuck are we paying you for then? Institution, you have a right to record. I know I do. But you <laughs> cannot record uh, the sign-in sheet. Oh, I can. I definitely can. Okay. No, you can't. I already did twice. Okay, but you so can. what should I do? Okay. You well, can. I've done it already. So what okay. now? If Whoa. you've done it already, should I delete you it or? Shouldn't have it. I would appreciate it if you delete it. I'm not going to do that, sir. Respectfully, okay. be honest with you. Okay, I can't stop you for anything you've already done. I'm telling you, you can't record the sign in sheet. Well, I've done it already, and I, and I think that you're uh, uh, totally misinformed, sir. Okay. I, thank um, you. The young lady, where, whomever her name is, how would I go by filing a complaint? What is your complaint? Uh, where she was very unprofessionally rude. Let us see Okay. Give me a. Line paper and take this complaint. Yeah. I, I think he's speaking of. Of whom? Uh, Gilmer. Yeah, yeah. He he know who he know who I was talking to. She was, I was just I right. Don't. Not you, sir. Okay. Yeah. What is it you're trying to request, sir? What? Well, well, in terms of FOIA? Yeah. Ah, I'm gonna keep that anonymous. Okay. I don't think the request can be anonymous because we have to have somewhere to send it to. Uh, well, I'll just come in and pick it up. I'll, you can you can fill out a FOIA request anonymously. You don't have to okay. give them. Yeah. Damn. Yellow. One bullshit lie after another. They're so incompetent. The funny thing is, folks, they're making it hard on themselves. That's the funny thing about all this is they can have this guy in and out like that if they just just do their job correctly. They don't want to. They don't know how. And this is the level of incompetence that we the people are paying for. And nothing is getting fixed. Nothing is operating. I mean, government is operating the way it's supposed to. I'm sorry, guys. I lied to you all. It's supposed to be incompetent. It's supposed to be broken. That way they could just make more government, more government, more government, more government, more government, more government. And nothing gets fucking fixed. If you don't believe me, look at the streets. You know, even Beverly Hills is crying because of the encampments. <laughs> we have solutions to all the problems, folks. Um, but chaos is how certain folks get rich. Here you go. If you'd like to make a complaint, you can do that here. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll get to it. Okay. I'll definitely get to it. Sean, if you're uncomfortable with him photographing you, I can take the desk for a while until he's done, and I'll take his complaint. Okay? I might bring a complaint back, though. So it's, okay. not, it's not a guarantee that I'll fill it out today, just like the okay. FOIA. That's good. Okay. Is there anything else I can help you with? Um, no, that'd be it. Um, I'm trying to make, to make sure, if you can, just make sure she didn't call the cops because she said she was. Okay. And if she does, I would want to... Hang around until they get here. I don't want to run and make it look like a runner or anything. I don't think you're running. No, I'm just saying that would be considered running. It's my did. opinion that you have a right to film. Okay. It's a public place. Well, can you please okay, I'll, I'll convey that your, to her? I'll take care of that after you're this here. Well, that's what I'm saying. I might bring the complaint back later. Okay, well, let me have my pad back if you're going to bring it back later. Uh, hey, is there anything else? Uh, I can so, do can we you? file online? No, there's no complaint form online. Really? Well, I'm definitely going to file one, so I guess before I leave, I'll get the... I offered the... you the opportunity to... Yeah, but you're trying to make me do it now, sir. No, I'm not trying to make you do <laughs> Why you take it back? <laughs> Why you take because the... you said you would do it later. So, so you took the pad back? Okay. Later meaning just in a few moments. Let me have, let me have that. You need to convey to your entire staff, though, what this is a First Amendment right. Because they it's seem the to not know. It's a First Amendment right, but you don't dictate what's sold to our staff. Do you guys park here in the parking lot with the patrons? 
Yes, we customers and stuff like that. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm gonna get some photos of the cars as well. Okay. Is there anything else I can help you with? Um, no, I'm not just glad to put that you back just, just to, to educate your staff. That that'll be great. Good luck to you, sir. All right, you too. All right. So I can't have her name. All staff's name are listed on the website. How do I identify her? Put it in your FOIA. And and what would I what would I be requesting if I don't know her name? That would be up to you to request what you want to request. Right now, now you're trying to be difficult, sir. No, I'm not trying to be. Difficult. And I understand. I, I understand because you're working with your your coworkers. You're trying to protect them, but you still you still have a duty, sir. You are because I'm asking you what's her name so I can file a complaint. Okay, sir. That's it. I'm not going to give you anybody's name. Okay. Well, we can. Well, I'm gonna, like a, my name. My name is Gerald Cole. Who? Gerald Cole. C O L E. Okay, well, I'm going to just go out here and document all the license plates, the cars, and get everybody's plate, and then, you know, we'll go from there. I mean, that's, since, you you know, we got to go that way. I ain't going to do it right now. I'm still going to hang around. You're welcome to record that's, in the public lobby. Can I have her name? You're welcome to record in the public lobby, but you're not welcome to record in the private area. Is her name Karen? No. Okay, I was, uh, I was thinking <laughs> it should be. If you record in the public area, I'm going to ask for you to be removed. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm going to respectfully right. decline. Yeah. If you're, we have already contacted somebody, so you can just okay. be Yeah, there. yeah, you probably can get back to work. Then. Okay, I've asked you to leave. Uh, sure. For what yeah, reason? Okay. Because you're because you're recording in private areas now. But is that against the law? It's not against the law. Thanks, it's that's against, all I need to know. It's against the law for you to record in a private area. What what statue is that? You got a penal code okay. that you can recite? Okay. Pers um, yeah, this this is the Karen here, y'all. Go. For all the world Both to of see. them are Karens. The one on the <laughs> left is just as guilty. She stirred <laughs> That's everybody ridiculous, up. That's ridiculous, man. Here we go, folks. How you doing today, officer? What's up, man? How are you? Man, pretty good. What's your name and badge number, officer? Kyle, 21807. You, you are your sheriff? Yeah. Lake County Sheriff? Oh, that's even better. Uh, up, the thing is, if you can uh, educate these young folks that what I'm doing is uh, constitutionally protected. Okay. I'm in the public space. All I'm doing is uh, gathering content for yeah. a story that I'm creating. Okay. Uh, I'm not doing anything nefarious. Don't have any ill intent today. Okay. Just want to be able to exercise my rights unmolested. Okay. So if you, sir, as a law enforcement officer, can you convey that to these young fine folks and we'll be good to go. I think, what, what, what do you need? You said it's about FOIA requests? Yeah, I already got it. I got that. And now I'm documenting the building. So I'm, I'm here for two things. Okay. Well, you know how that's kind of seems strange. I understand. I'm not, you know what? You know what? what real quick, officer? What's up? People put pan, peanut butter on pancakes. That's true. That's strange, but it it's is. not illegal. Right. <laughs> so. Okay, so, but I think... Hold on a fucking minute, bro. I put peanut butter on pancakes. That shit is good. <laughs> peanut butter on pancakes is scrumptious. Not kidding. If you haven't tried it, try it. I'm just saying. It's not weird. What they're saying, Maybe it is. I don't know. They don't have any business. Like, that's it. Uh -huh. I mean, get what you need and, and get out. Right? I understand. That's what they were requesting. So they, still, they still got business to do, too, right? Oh, they, I'm not doing anything to yeah. impede. So I guess, Absolutely not. I guess what I'm asking is, what, what do you need from them? Well, well, I, w I got the FOIA right there, as you can see. Which one? This one right to the left. Yeah, exactly. That's the sheet. So I'm going to fill that out and bring that back. What is it for, though? Uh, for them or for... It's, it's for me. Okay. It's for me. Right. Um, this young man here, he gave me a, pa a pad or something because I need to file a, um, I need to file a complaint on her. I thought her name was Karen, but he won't give me her name, so I don't. how do I obtain it? Okay. Right. How do I accumulate, gather her name, you know, right. without anybody so telling me? you got me. this. Yeah. You want to file a complaint? That's correct. I need her name to do so. First name and last initial, is that good? Um, yeah, because they're, think about it, uh, officer, real oh, quick. Well, they're, they're public, of, yeah, they're public workers. They have to give them their name anyway. Okay, what's your, what's your first name then? Gilma. Gilma. That's Gilma. Gilma. Gilma, okay. 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 All right. Okay. Nice. And then, and then again, like I said, if you can inform them that, you know, we have a First Amendment right. Yeah. To record in public, uh, that's precisely what I'm doing. Okay, but so if they have different, I don't know their rules. But no, we talking about we talking about the laws, officer. I understand. Talking about the laws, right? So you have laws, right? That's correct. So once you come into an establishment, mm -hmm. right? Just like 
you're free to not wear your shirt or shoes, right? But some places are like, hey. Private, though. Shirt, With, shoes, or service. That's a thin line between private and public. I mean, I'm not here to argue semantics. Of course not. If they're, if they're just asking you to, hey, can you just tone it down or can you stop yeah. the recording? No, they weren't even asking me that. They was asking me to leave. Okay, that's they, what I'm saying. Because I don't know the situation. I don't know if you told them what your business was or not. But yeah, I did. I, to this young man right here, he didn't want man one to say, right. I need you to leave. Okay, so I'm not doing anything you illegal. Got, but you got what you needed, right? Yeah, that's one thing. Right. So, yes, sir. I told him he could record in the public lobby. Mm -hmm. I told him he couldn't record through the window to the private area. Okay, and that's well, and, that, and that's that, a little bit different, and, right? Yeah, but that's 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 a lie. Uh, okay, well, for that, lack of a better term, right? not here, and I'm not I'm not going to sit and watch all the video, right? Uh, of no, course, no one's going to be. In no, 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 no. Right? Let me let so me make it clear. It wasn't a lie that I recorded through this window. It's a lie that he said I can't do it. That's okay. yeah. Okay, so now he's now he's asking, hey, please don't record through the window. Yeah, but I but I respectfully decline. Is that fair? With all respect, with all due respect, but I, he's asking you not to record through. I know it's a, it's a private area. You know, it's no, it's locked. not. I'm, they they I'm, have to access. You have to be accessed into it, right? Okay, but I'm public. I'm standing in public right here. So, you <laughs> so if I'm at, you want to fill out the complaint then? No, not right now. But I want to make this clear to you, Sheriff. I, I'm clear. I want to. Go. Okay, as long as you're clear. Right. So let's fill out the complaint. You can turn it in, and then we should be good to go. Yeah, but I'm not going to do it right now. I'm not going to have you guys just force me to do something. That I'm not ready. I'm not to do. forcing you. This, folks. I'm going to screenshot that shit because that's going to be my fucking thumbnail. What we are seeing is these folks, they were going to use their presumed authority. They're trying to turn it into unbridled power. And that shit right now is getting deleted. Delete laws is a sham. They're not going to delete the laws, you know, to adhere to their feelings. And the law is the law. This man has broke no law. He's in there recording. And, you know, the same laws that we have to abide by so do they if they want to stipulate themselves you know and write down policy here policy there policy every freaking where and put policies upon themselves i'm all for it as long as those policies don't overstep the boundaries and cross over to the line on the side of where the people's rights are because that's where the people come in that's where first amendment auditing takes place that's where the people come to watch the people stand up for the people's rights. Hey, that ass. Keep watching. Well, it sounds like you're giving me directives. It looks, it looks like we're, we're done with what we need to do. I'm not done. I'm, what, I'm, what I'm, I'm, con I'm conducting a First Amendment right, sir. This is protected by the Constitution. Okay. Uh, there's something that you. There's more auditing to be done, and there's more ass to be kicked. Let's keep watching. Or an oath to uphold. Right. It's okay. If, if, right, but. I guess what I'm saying is we're good then, right? We got what we need for for, for just these this one and two. I'm still here well, <laughs> gathering I mean, content, sir. Why are you leaving out number three? What content? I mean, it's it's like 900 square feet. How much? Do you I need? mean, what does that mean? What does that mean? There's no time frame for me to be here. This is public, sir. No, I'm not definitely not going to leave. I'm definitely not going to leave. I'm not doing nothing illegal. Okay, but <laughs> so. you're impeding them from doing their business. Oh, by recording? She just said, because they need other people in let me, here. Let, let, me, let me say this to you, uh, mm -hmm. Sheriff. What's your last name again? My first name is Kyle. Kyle. Last name, McManaway. McManaway. My badge number is 21807. Great. Let me let me okay. say this real quick. You, you, right. Obviously, you're... This deputy is trying to shoo this McManaway, guys. He's trying... McManaway is trying to shoo the McMahon away. <laughs> No way, Jose. I'm familiar with Deputy Cavelli, right? Yeah. You probably should contact them before you do something wrong, man. Because if you're going to come here and try to enforce their policy and your law enforcement, then it's going to come down on you personally, sir. Okay. Because it's, it's just well, like, perfectly it's like honest trespassing, you. right? Absolutely not. Okay. You can't so trespass they're, in they're, public. They're asking you to, to leave. They're asking me to leave for, for, for what crime? What crime did I commit? saying you committed a crime. I'm just asking you to leave. Because well, I have a right to say no, don't I? As an American citizen. Taking your video. Who, it's not up to listen, you listen, or them to tell me taking, what I'm done. But you said you've taken your content. I'm not done, though. You got your FOIA request, and then she gave you the first name to fill out the, the complaint. That's correct. Okay, so what else do we need to do? Okay, so I'm going to say this one more time. Because they're still trying to do business. They can, they, I'm not going to impede on that at all. Let them conduct their business. He's obstructing us taking care of our public business. Fucking you know, crybaby. He has no other business oh, here. 
we would like him Officer, to I need a hug, please. I, I, like I said, I have business here. I'm conducting a First Amendment constitutionally protected activity, sir. Have you been in touch with any of our commander or anything? Were in recent times? or yeah, recent I'm, Like I said, I know Deputy Cavelli like this. He, he, if, I guarantee if you get him on the radio... No, I don't have an ID, and I don't just provide ID. I, I don't want to get that right now, Sheriff. Well, why not? I mean, well, I have a right now, to. Now I, we're I, go into this whole like you're impeding my investigation. How? I don't, so, so hold on. I have to. Do I have to aid you in your investigation? So what's, what's your first thing? I'm not going to give you that offer. I don't think I don't. I don't as long as I haven't committed a crime, I'm not suspected of a crime. I, I have a right, a Fourth Amendment right, to not give you my name, and you know that. Now he's going to put the fucking cop in check in front of the people. This is such a beautiful video because of the fact that, you know, all this presumed authority has been floating around for so fucking long. And, you know, it just, this guy comes in here like 10 feet tall, total, total uh, termination of their tyranny. <laughs> and that's why he's the... Uh, Tyrant Terminator audits, right? <laughs> Fuck yeah. I'm going to go ahead and customer because he's impeding our business here. Wow. What's your, what's your first name, sir? I'll, I'll, all you got to do is contact Deputy Cavelli. He'll tell you everything you need to know. And that's your deputy. Well, he's, he's the deputy chief. Yes, exactly right. I mean, if you contact him now, he'll let you know everything you need to know. Okay. So what's, what's your, what business are you trying to do? None of your fucking business. I, I got the foyer. I understand that. That's one. What, what video are you trying to take? I'm taking video now. For what? I'm already doing it. Now, it. Fuck I'm taking it for my personal self. Just to watch? I, just because I have a First Amendment right you to do it. You said you want to take a video to make a documentary? Or... Yeah, create content for a story. That's right. For so me. What's your story? Well, the story is on this uh, housing authority. Well, and now it's going to be on rude, unprofessional housing authority personnel. What's wrong with the housing authority? Uh, everything now that I see, they're, they're ruled. Well, what started it? What well, you know, I got a couple of different complaints about this site particularly. Mm -hmm. And um, I was like, no, nah, I don't think they're like that. And then I come in here and they're precisely like, well, not her. She's been great. It's just oh, her. And that, and now that man, he's coming with the rudeness as well. So yeah. uh, we definitely want to document that and disseminate it to the public so they can see yeah. what they're in for when they come up here. This lady over here on the on the left in the back. She's confused as fuck because she knows she ain't great at all. She knows she started the whole shit and she's sitting there like, oh, like, fuck. I don't know what happened. <laughs> fuck, no. She hella guilty like everybody else in there. Look at her face, dude. <laughs> Both of them. <laughs> Unbelievable. Stop here or stop utilizing it. Uh, uh, not even really stop, but just be prepared mentally on what they might have to endure. Yeah, that's it. And like I say, Sheriff, if you want to contact up, he knows me personally and precisely what I'm doing is legal. There's another sheriff on the way in. Let me see your ID or going to jail. She's in uniform, man. I haven't the seen this might video. Be Grace so. Lake, though. We're watching Let's this see. together, folks. Right. Let's see what happens. How are you doing, officer? How are you doing? Pretty good. Are you, um... I'm from Lake County Sheriff's Office. Oh, okay. I was just telling this young man, um... Yeah, I was just speaking to this young man, letting him know the same thing. Like, if you guys wanted to possibly, like, contact Deputy Chief Cavelli. Yeah. Because he's familiar with Yeah, he called me, and, and he said that you just need to make sure that you're getting whatever information you're looking for. Yeah, I actually got it. You know, I'm just... Now I'm just okay. documenting the building. Yeah, okay. yeah nothing not nefarious. Private areas or anything? Of course else? not. Okay. I'm just right here in the lobby. Yes, he is recording private areas. He's sticking Because he's saying I'm going to yeah, educate yeah, this man. I have Edu to ask the door. Educate no, him to now. Door, so technically. Politely not to record private areas. Okay, we'll try not to record into like. Oh, shit. I'm right here. Yeah. Right there, literally. Okay. Well, that's going to be an issue. Thanks a lot. Okay. There's another sheriff ready to come on in. That's my, that's my sergeant. Oh, that's the sergeant? Yeah. Man, man, hold on. You know what? I'm going to try to get this name right, man. Oh, Sergeant Zinkowicz. Zinkowicz. Just like oh. a sandwich, but a little bit different. Zinkowicz. Oh, yes, okay. I'm right on. But anybody ever call you Officer Z? A lot of people do. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> 
Appreciate it. What's your badge number, Sergeant, if you don't mind? 2041. Appreciate that. Thanks a lot. They want to I guess they're saying that he's recording the, I guess there's a silence list. Which is public record because it's out in the open. Is this deputy a rookie or what? Because he doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. Look at his face. Does this look like the face of a man who knows what he's doing? Uh-uh. Nope. That face says, I am confused this right here. I don't know what is going on. <laughs> you mean it's not illegal? <laughs> no, dude. It's not illegal. If there's something in the public area, we can't stop them from doing it. So if you guys want there to you go. Something to Fuck yeah. Okay. And then real quick. As long as she remains in the public area, then we can make it right. Thanks a lot, officer. Out fucking standing. He's not, he's not harming your business. He's not going to do anything that's going to harm your business. Yes. He's in the public Absolutely. Right how fucking standing that, that's that's by their choice to not come in he is not breaking the law in any manner whatsoever and we can't How he's not disturbing peace he's just standing. recording thank you it doesn't but again but legally, there's nothing i can do he's not breaking the law that's exactly right how fucking standing <laughs> Look at the face. Look at her face. If it's something that's visible from the public area, he's got full legal right to record it. Thanks Champion. a lot. Champion. All right. Anything else we can do for you today? I appreciate Anything that, officer. That'd be it. Right she said they're going to shut down the business. Oh. Yeah, I think that's a lead. If you're shutting down the business and no one else can come in, then, then you just let him know that you're closed for the day. Okay. And I'm, I'm guessing, the and, gentleman, if you're closed for the day, then, then he'll leave. And I'm going to be perfectly okay. honest with you, Sarge. If they does shut down the building and, and to where everybody has to be on the outside and literally say we're shutting down for the day with locked doors, then, of course, I'll leave. Yeah, the doors are automatically locked. Right, but, but again, it's still a public place that people come into, so he's fully legal with okay, those we'll rights. Talk, we'll talk about it. Okay. If, you, if you are closed down for the day, but if you open and resume backup duties, he can come back in. Okay. Right. Which they'll be open tomorrow, right? I guess it's right. <laughs> Is there anything else we can help you No, I didn't need any help from the beginning, Sergeant. I appreciate you a lot, man. Out fucking standing. Outstanding, people. This is what America is all about. This is what First Amendment auditing is all about. This is why the people love these videos and appreciate First Amendment audits. If, 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 you, if you don't like First Amendment audits, you must be a hater of the people of the freedoms you know what i mean of, of natural rights and this is what it's all about this is what and, and and i gotta tell you sheriffs right are elected um to be there and they're the ones that are really supposed to be enforcing you know the constitution you know the people's rights and making sure they're not being trampled on and violated and that's exactly what this three striped this three chevron deputy came in to do he did the right thing and for that he gets a 10 out of 10 in my opinion out fucking standing this one right here on the right the woman i guess she gets about a, a six she would have had a 10 but she tried to tell him not to record in the back so we won't give her a low score the other one in the blue we're giving him a minus one because <laughs> that guy didn't know shit about shit and he kept trying he had to ask this one can he do this? Can he do that? I don't know about this. And his his face was like, I don't know what's left of this video, but I, I, I absolutely love this guy. I absolutely love this Tyrant Terminator audits, his demeanor. I hope his channel keeps growing. And we're going to make that happen. We are with you 100%. We are with you. We will continue to help your channel grow. Thanks a lot, Officer Liz. Uh, and, Sar and Sergeant Z. Deputy. Appreciate you guys. Deputy. Man, you too. So yeah, those those last two officers was great. Uh, the first guy probably he he probably need a little bit more training, man. Just a tad yep. bit more training, uh, you know. But that's okay. He don't even and have it, his it, uniform. I guess yet. these people say they're gonna they're gonna try to shut down the business for the day. And I, I gotta ask one question though: as government workers, can you just automatically have a government shutdown whenever you want?
Business hours are Monday through Friday, 8 to 4, right? Or 8 to 5? You mean to tell me that government could just shut itself down whenever it wants, folks? Uh Uh-uh. The people pay taxes for government to operate correctly. And now government is upset because the people want to hold them accountable? What happens when misappropriation of funds start happening? When people go in there to ask questions, you're going to shut them down? You see where we're getting at? You see what's happening, folks? Uh, If they do that, somebody's going to be in trouble. (laughs) Somebody's definitely going to be in trouble. I wish you would point out how this lady started started the whole shit. Look at this guy. Look at this polio. Create privacy. There you go. He wants people to look at him. I, I came in here minding my own business, man. Got and got um approached by <laughs> this young lady, which was rude and mean. So I started to be rude and mean back. No, you weren't. You weren't even rude. And oh, mean. That's you. You, you, you. I know you're saltier than a peanut because. No, oh, absolutely, saltier you are. Saltier than a peanut. Because you called the cops, <laughs> hoping that they would come some authority. <laughs> And they, oh, and, and, and they flex the authority on you guys. So. I didn't, I didn't call well, whomever called. Yeah. Okay. Good luck to you, bro. Good luck to you, you too. bro. Lock yourself out, man. Good luck to you. Get back in there, man. Fucking whips. Bunch of crack babies in that place. <laughs> this guy. Go in there, hug each other. He said it's unusual. This is the guy Salt that said it was unusual. Peanut. TTA family. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, oh, guy, that, that guy walked out and what, smiled. Did, did, like, you, did, did you want to talk to the cops? No. Oh, okay. My fault. My fault. My fault. It wasn't him. It wasn't him. Yeah. I was Look at this it guy. It was somebody. He didn't somebody care. Yeah, but this yeah. young lady right here, man, she's that been man great. Amazing. She's been professional. No, she the whole hasn't. Time, Look at her. Man. Guilty as all hell. It's, just the, it's the other ones. She knows man, she that, is. Uh, that was. That's been horrible. She went to go it's stare at the manager. Everybody back there. But you know. That you know, man as soon as the cops leave, we're going to book out of here, man. You know, I, I think it was a success. You know, matter of fact, we, we can leave now. I think your challenge you know, they might lock is me out. a success. Yeah, yeah, they might lock me out. They will lock you man, out. We, we, we want to wait till the cops pull off. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah. There's nothing, uh, see, man, really there's nothing that's, left that's to crazy, say to those man, cops, how, folks. You know, really is nothing left to say to those cops. Like, it's, that's, it's just He it's did just everything. Weird, man. He did everything right really on this weird. video. He did everything perfect on this video. This video is Another tits. Cop, man. He needs a lot of training, man. Lots of training. That cop right there with the khaki, khaki color pants on, black vest, blue shirt. He needs a ton of training. And hopefully they'll give it to him because uh, you know, he was trying to get my name and you know, I mean, it's crazy. It's crazy, but it is what it is. One of the best new channels out there, man. I fucking love this guy. That voice too, man. Holy shit. You could do a whole damn radio show, bro. It is what it is. <laughs> How about we guest host a, a podcast or radio show or something? I'd love to do a podcast episode with you. Leave. I'm going out of here. Uh-huh. <laughs> was that the lady that was out there so, waiting a long time? Fucking incompetent public servants. I felt like I made my point. Uh, yeah, you did. Yes, you did. You did. Yes. Uh, huh? I can't hear you. Haha, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do I have what? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, <laughs> come on. Are this you lady serious? came out smiling, <laughs> laughing. Shit's hilarious. Are you Are you serious? <laughs> oh my god! I, I can't. I'm <laughs> <laughs> she just was mad too. Hey, All of you, a sudden. I swear to God, out of everybody, you've been the most professional. I nope. swear to uh-huh. God. And I appreciate that. She even made a horn gesture like she got a hey, horn she, on She sure head. is. She sure is. And you've been professional as well. Straight up. Oh, these shoes? <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. They got them at uh Gurney Mill. And what's up? Uh, I go to the band. I got the membership You know what? It might be jerk journeys. They got me. They got like adult sizes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Appreciate that. Now, as soon as the police pull off, man, I'm out of here, man. So we got some uh, everybody can go back to being uh, normal. I like white shoes. Too. Yeah, yeah, I did. I'm going to file a complaint, too, but I'm going to bring all that back. Yeah. So I'm just waiting for them to pull off, and I'm out of here, man. So looks like they all left, so I'm out of here. <laughs> all right, what's your name? Katrina. Katrina, appreciate it. Thanks a lot. All right. Oh, yeah, nice lady. Very nice. <sighs> Nice. All right, TTA family. So, uh, sign me up came. for the TTA fam. Educate. Uh, I the housing be a authorities of the TTA personnel fam. here. Uh, man, they was, man, they was terrible, man. The guy, the black guy came out, whatever his name is, Mr. Cole or whatever, he came out. Made I'll sign this out, man. You guys, I want to be an official member of the TTA fam. Straight up. I love this guy. I absolutely love this guy. I love the way he handles himself. He conducts himself professionally. I love this video. You know, uh, I want to give him a 10 out of 10, but I, I got to take a point away because the first lady is the one that stirred everybody up. She could have just did her job correctly. Now, I know she could have probably just win. Maybe she wasn't sure. I'm going to give her the benefit of the doubt and say she wasn't sure, so she had to go ask the manager. And the manager came down, so let's not be too hard on her, right? Or she could have just done her job <laughs> the first time. But, yeah, maybe we'll just, we're not going to take a point away. We'll, we'll make it a, a 10 out of 11. How's that? We'll do 10 out of 11 on this video. Nah, man, straight up. Uh, to be serious, I love this guy's work. And I want to see more. I want to continue to see more. So with this video, let's see if we can get him to 10,000 subscribers. Right now, he has 8,660-something subscribers. 27 videos. Outstanding work, man. Outstanding work, bro. I love it. I want to, I want to continue to see your work. And I want to continue to help your channel grow. Because you deserve it. And, uh... Shit, hopefully, who knows, man? Hopefully, maybe up in the future, man, we'll both be walking side by side with our fucking shiny white leather shoes. And one of the reasons why I like white leather shoes is because they're easy to keep clean. You know, they get a little scuffy, just whoosh, wipe them off, and you're shining again, right? I mean, I don't want to have to wear a brand new pair of shoes every single day. That shit's expensive. But anyways, man, I'd love to rock and roll with uh, TTA. And maybe do some audits with them in the future. Who knows, man? Maybe we can make that shit happen. Anyhow, thank you all for tuning in. Go subscribe. I'll drop the original link in the description and in the pinned comment. One of the best audits that I've seen. I loved it. Loved it. All right, folks. Have yourselves a blessed day. Peace.